the grandma and the mom uh, to sort of uh, between a traditional medicine and and uh, let me say white medicine if I use it like that. So I want maybe to take that uh, that bit because it really brings out uh, you know how she works in language and uh, the things that you know give us something to to latch on. Okay, so I'll, I'll start. Um, okay. um, so this is about a mother and a house. Her house was an increasing and unceasingly full of people whose intentions were never clear. Close relatives, distant relatives, sometimes their children and their home. It was a three bedroom house in the compound that had beds in all the rooms except the bathroom and the toilet. There were two double beds in the living room, one in the kitchen, two in each of the other two bedrooms. Her bedroom only had one bed for her and her old father. The house was free lodging, free food, free water, free air for liberal party. Stay as long as you want. She only had two children, three years apart, and the sister and I. In an ideal world, we could each have our own bedroom, but in mother's world, sharing was caring, and relatives were more important. Only she was suspicious of one of them. This suspicion got worse when my sister then, 22, had her first child, and being the youngest relative in the house, my nephew was brought at home by everyone. They all gave him goodly eyes, kissed him, threw him up and down, took time sleeping with him, and he was always ill. If it was not his stomach, it was a persistent, ugly, fish scale rush on his body. My mother attributed this to the reform hall, and would sometimes send me and my sister out to look for and the water to drown me. She showed the plant to us once, only once. She had come back home after leaving early in the morning, her feet were dusty. She had black dirt on her dress and was sweating with that small sweat of hers. After washing up, she called my sister and I to her room with her grandchild, closed the door and told us to watch and plant. She pulled out a bunch of leaves with tiny yellow flowers from her handbag and put them in front of her nose and eyes. Smell and look at these leaves, those leaves very carefully, she said. What are these? My sister asked with a sunny accent of a very light thing. My sister was and still is the most gorgeous human being I've ever seen. Mother had always told my sister that her face would get her pregnant by a useless man before her time. It did. To my mother's satisfaction, it was indeed a talent dressed G. <laughs> he dressed like a kind of woman but had no clear understanding of what a disc jockey was to understand. He did not have an ear. And a part time, my mother said that she started plucking the leaves with her right hand and holding them into the same place. What is it for, I asked? To protect my grandchild, what else? Mom, I don't like witchcraft, my sister said. Then who say it is witchcraft? Do you think I can reach my own blood? We always do weird things to protect us from this and that, and sometimes we just wonder if you're actually causing us harm and blocking our blessings. Look at my wife, and your son here feels it's for four phenomena. I don't want my son to end up wondering as well. Um, if I, if my mother said, if I didn't learn any of those things, you and your brother would be dead. And now some of my relatives are very jealous, and I have to protect you people. My sister was talking about all the hubs we had to speak at different milestones and points of our lives and the cuts filled with ash of X or Y combined with crushes and pungent water by bombarding <coughs> a tire with somebody someone's water. Mother swore they were the reason we were still alive and at that not but no more. Yet now it was under water. After plucking the leaves, uh, mother put them in a small blue cup and brushed them to a paste and we one end of a row with it. She then put a half of it in a half empty tin of petroleum jelly and mixed them together. The rest she left in the cup and told my skeptical and weak sister to put a little bit in bad water every day, just a little. Then she instructed my sister to remove his clothes and let her rub in the water jelly. Mom, the doctor said it's a weird thing and gave me special medicine for each of me and told me to remove milk from his dad. I even have cream, I don't think we should be mixing with this thing. Is it working? It will. If it was working, then it would have, it would have been. Really 